Active learning ambush. Active learning ambush. Let's see who I can find. I'm gonna visit the CTLE again to see who is hanging out. Oh, hello. Hi, hey, Tanisha. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm well, thanks. So I am ambushing people for the active learning ambush. Ah. So um, I'm looking for active learning strategies. Sure, I have a strategy. So okay. I'm Heather. All right. And I teach teachers in teacher education. So those that want to become teachers. Okay. Uh, so what is a strategy you usually share with your teachers or with your my students teachers. or students? So it's a super simple strategy, actually, and it's okay. one that I use at the beginning of the semester, okay. usually to build relationships. It's called Find Somebody Who. I okay. imagine everybody knows what this is. Okay. Normally, we create a grid that looks oh. like this. All right. Right? And at the beginning of the semester, we say walk around the room and find somebody who speaks several languages or likes chocolate ice cream or their favorite subject is phys ed. And when you find somebody, you sign their box, right? Mm -hmm. And the goal is to either fill in the paper or to get a bingo. But at this time in the semester, I change it for test review or for subject content understanding. So for instance, this one we based it on bullying and harassment and all the concepts that we learned in class. Okay. And today they had to go around and ask somebody, what's the definition of bullying? Tell me what the difference is between aggressor and bystander. And if they knew that, then they would sign their friend's paper. Okay. And the first person who gets a bingo got a few extra credit points today. Ooh. So it's an old school strategy, find somebody who, but I move it into content versus just relationship building. Have you noticed that your students are really responsive with the find someone who? I really do because they compare their understandings and I think they get into some really deeper conversations about it. They're like, well, I thought it meant this, but I thought it meant this. And then a third person might join the conversation. And so we begin to clarify our understanding. And then when it's done, I, of course, the winners people who've come up first, I take their papers and verify their answers by calling out the people who signed their paper for them to verify the correct answer. Okay. So it's pretty fun too because the person who won is usually like, you sure you know this? Right. <laughs> right. So it puts this little edge to it and then, you know, it just, it runs the discussion and it's just a little bit livelier. It's nothing more than a review really. Okay. Well, that's great. Thank yeah, you. Thank you so much welcome. for sharing. Till we meet again.